I really wanted to love the Barbie movie. I loved Barbies when I was a kid and I hoped that the movie would be something of a love letter to the doll that inspired really so much fantasy and storytelling for me as a kid, but instead the film is basically a tangle of grown-up daddy issues rebranded as female empowerment. The opening scene shows little girls bashing their baby dolls on rocks. It's this symbolic rejection of motherhood. And the final scene is one where Barbie is so empowered and self-actualized that she visits a gynecologist for the first time. The movie really criticizes women's impulses towards motherhood, towards love, towards femininity, and it leaves the lead character standing alone in the real world with no friends, no husband, no children, and only the medical industrial complex by her side. The movie basically it sets out to define the doll, but also to define women, to establish a way to create meaning without family, relationships, connections, love. There's nothing empowering about having no idea of how to find meaning or how to make your life matter. The film doesn't love the toy, it hates it. The film doesn't love women or their feminine impulses, it hates them. And as for Ken, the film has no use for him and doesn't think women have much use for men either. You know, I was obsessed with Barbie as a kid. My mom was not. She indulged me though, and I uh, had a Barbie dream house. It was the dream beach house. And I played with that thing for hours with my friends, mostly imagining Barbies in all kinds of future scenarios, but mostly romantic ones. My mom was a feminist. She didn't like the dolls. Maybe she thought they were too stereotypical, too entrenched in gender roles, too pretty, too smiley, who knows, but while playing with me, with Barbies, me and my friends talked about boys. Our eyes didn't shine with grand career plans when we thought about our future lives, but with fantasies about what our relationships might be like, what our homes might be like, what it might like to be a mom and have a family. And as much as the movie seeks to empower women and to elevate them to positions of power, it also looks to eliminate men and diminish the concept of partnership. It falls into the same problem that feminism does. It portrays women at war with themselves and in a struggle against their own nature. For more content like this, subscribe to The Post Millennial.